What up, what up, what up? It's the kickback kid. Yo, E3. No, it's over. Ooh. Well, I mean, it's kind of over, but you know, it's not really over because we can always go back. We can go back, you know, we can go back, 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 back in time. I can dream. It's a time machine. I'm singing a simple thing. Yeah. Yo, E3, skiggity. Man. Uh, I got to say, it wasn't all that, but it was still nice. Look, let me kick off and let me give my thoughts on um the my, my, my top three from my last video. Nah, skip all that. Skip, skip, skip. I hate how you got to press start in this game. Like, ugh. Come on, boy. Bop, bop. Come on, boy. Bop, bop. He don't want them to kick back here. Hey, y'all see that theme, though? I know y'all see the theme. I know y'all see. Look at that purple. Hey, yo. yo, let me show my people. That per look at that purple suit, the purple knight. God dang. Okay, he he. Okay, I see you want to do it the hard way. He want to do it the hard way. Okay, all right. Come here. I see he want to do it the hard way. Boy, get that hate out your heart. Anyways, though, so, um, yeah, you see the purple skin. It's looking nice. It's looking right. Yo, check it out though. You know, um, let me get my uh. I'm jumping all over the place. No, let me talk about my my skin first. I want to brag about it because it looks nice. I didn't earn it, nothing. I just put this game on and I was able to pick it. I was like, what the? And I seen it and I'm like, okay. Nightmare is representing uh, kickback gaming, you know, purple theme. I'm definitely with it. You know, I'm definitely feeling it. I'm with it, you know. I'm with it, I'm with it. Skiggity goo. But um, anyways, uh, Cyberpunk, which was my most anticipated uh, at E3. <sighs> I mean, okay, so we didn't see no gameplay, but for what we did see, I liked it. It, it was cool. I mean, that game still looked legitty. You know, legitty my word, side note. Ski. You know, but, um, meaning I'm the originator. But look, never mind that. We didn't see gameplay. I'm going to see if I can get a ring out. Hold up. Is he stupid enough for me to, is he stupid enough for me to give him a ring out? Let me, let me see if I can get a ring out. Did I get it? No, I did not. <clears throat> Anyways, Cyberpunk, we didn't get gameplay, but I mean, for what we did get, I did like what, what you know, what I seen. Um, I mean, the game still look hot. It still look dope. My thoughts on the trailer, uh, it's cool. I mean, I, I just want to play it. I'm glad they got a date, but I got a feeling they're going to push it back. I think it said April 16th, but don't hold me to that. I think it said April 16th, 20, to be exact, 4, 16, 20. But I mean, like, eh, I just wish we would have had some gameplay, but I mean, I get it. Maybe it's still too soon. Now session, I'm disappointed. I really, 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 really wanted to see um, gameplay for session, and we didn't get that. So I'm a little disappointed about that. You know, I was hoping that there'll be some gameplay. Now I didn't dig too deep. I didn't do my homework too much on E3 as far as like um, people who've been there. You know, I didn't really uh, look into it because I mean, who knows? Maybe session was probably you know um, on the show floor. You know. Um, in the in the uh, in the Microsoft spot. I mean, do I know? I know, obviously not. But um, I don't know. You know, I, I'm gonna look into that though. Maybe maybe it was there at E3. Maybe it was playable. I don't really know. But I'm gonna try to find out. And if it is, I'm definitely gonna let y'all know. Ski. You know what I'm saying? To try to get some information from the people who played the game. Uh, I wish they would have showed. Um, boy, you need to stop. I wish. Boy, boy, you need to stop. Hold on, just stop it. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Powered up on them. But look, um. Yeah, no gameplay is that, as, as far as I'm concerned, at least. So, that's that on that. Uh, on that game. Ghost Recon uh, Breaking Point, however, there was gameplay on that. Mm, you know what I'm saying? Tasty, scrumptious. You know, delicioso. Serio. But, um, I, you know, we got to see some gameplay of it. You know, it looked dope. It's cool. Um, I mean, Ghost Recon usually never lets me down. It's always a... Ah, oh, dang, I thought I was going to catch him with that. Oh, 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 okay, he getting aggressive. He, You getting too aggressive, son. All right, okay, all right. This how you want to play? Oh, wow, he got me. He got me. I got a little cocky, I ain't going to lie. I tried to do a little step back combo. Whatever, forget it. Um, <clears throat> Tie this up real quick. What All that nonsense. What are you... I'm sitting up here. Boy, we, we talking about E3, and you're being rude. You're being rude here. You're being rude, sir. Hold up. Uh, that's not what I was looking for. I was looking for the grab move. Oh, he gonna break the grab. That was an accident. That was an accident. <laughs> oh, man. 
that was an accident too. God dang it. Oh well, tied it up. No, did I? I don't know what happened. What happened? I beat him. Oh, I thought I lost the last round. Forget it. Who cares? This, this is not important. I'm just playing this to have something to talk over. Um, what was I talking about? Jesus Christ. Uh, oh yeah, breaking point. There was there was gameplay breaking point. My thoughts on it. Eh, I'm honestly not that impressed, but the game still looks like it's gonna be sick. Um, now. I haven't really played, uh, no, I haven't played Wildlands, uh, Ghost Recon Wildlands, but I remember, um, watching it, at, watching people play it and streaming and stuff, and I wasn't, I wasn't too impressed with this, so I didn't buy it, you know, but it looked it really, really sick before it came out, and I'm kind of afraid that Breaking Point might be that way, but I don't know, maybe that might just be me being, you know, traumatized and just scarred, you know, from the last, uh, Breaking Point, I mean, from the last, uh, Ghost Recon, excuse me. Um, I'm still gonna, I have ring out, I'm still gonna, um, make the purchase for, uh, Wildlands, is that what it was called, the, the previous Ghost Recon, I'm still gonna, um, purchase that, it's like 20 bucks on PSN, so I'm gonna just, you know, mess with it, and, you know, kinda play it and use it as a countdown until the next Ghost Recon comes out, but Breaking Point, my thoughts on the gameplay, I, honestly, I'm gonna say, guys, I briefed at it, I didn't really look at it too much, but, I mean, it looked dope, I'm, I'm just not trying to be, you know, I'm not trying to be so, well, I better be careful. Oh, be careful. Circle. Circle. Man, cut it out. Oh, I tried. To, I thought I was going to catch him. thought I was going to catch him. Boy, stop it. I'm a boss. Boy, stop it. I'm a boss. Boy. But anyways, um... Jesus Christ, what was I talking about? I'm always all over the place every time I do this. Uh... Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Uh, brain freeze, brain freeze. Well, let me in the meantime until it come back. Let me focus. Let me focus on smacking up Maxi. Maxi, calm down. Maxi, stop it. Hold on. Siéntate. Wait a minute. That didn't work. That didn't work. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. He want to play. Okay. All right. You want to talk about mothers? I got you. Mmm. I can also be a. Mmm. Mm, I can also be a spam king. You want me to be a spam king? Is that what you want? Huh? I'm a boss, son. Okay, where was I? Uh, breaking point. I was just finishing up breaking point. Um, it's okay. Okay, I wasn't really too impressed with the gameplay. Anyways, uh, moving on. Uh, I hear there's a Resident Evil 8 coming. There was they didn't show anything on that, but I mean I just think that's worth mentioning because Resident Evil is sick. I mean, nerd, der. Uh. Madden 20 from uh, for my sports fans. Now I hate Madden, but um, I don't know. This Madden actually looks kind of good. I don't know, but I mean I always get deceived by Madden year in and year out. So I'm thinking more than likely this is just gonna be one of those times, you know, where I, I'm just deceived again. Uh, fun fact. Honestly, you can't really say I can't say that that's a fun fact, but it's a fact. I bought Mad 19 and I never played it. I know that sounds really dumb, but it's the truth. I just never got around and played it. So I can't even judge Mad 19, you know. But um 20 20 looks good. I'm just going to leave it at that. Whoa, how did my blood get so low? Jesus. Oh my god. Anyways, um Madden 20, you know, I know that's like really really left field like, huh? But I mean, I'm in the sports games. Well, I would be in the Madden if I liked it. I would be, you know. I hate that that we only have Madden as a football game. Man, this dude is bodying me. Calm down, son. I'm going to have to spam you. You're doing too much. Nah, son. Nah, nah son. Nah, nah, son. I'm not going out like that, son. I don't care. I'll turn into a spam king in a minute. But, um, Madden looks okay. You know, but enough about Matt. Let's talk about the real games. Let's talk about that Wolfstein. Wolfstein, what was it? Uh, Blood. Hold on, excuse me. I got a ratchet I got to take care of. Oh, wow, he fell for it? You idiot. Oh, no, no, he didn't. He, he blocked that. He blocked it. <laughs> he fell for that, though. Took his, took them legs out. But, um, Wolfstein, I think it's Wolfstein Youngblood or something like that. I don't know the full name. I might be wrong, but um, Wolfstein, Wolfstein, man, I seen the gameplay trailer of that, the shooting in that game looks crazy, I don't know what type of engine that game is running on, but I like how the blood is like splattering all over the place, that game looks dope, I'm not even really, wow, punk, 
I'm not even really uh, that big on shooters, but um, Wolfstein, I think, looks dope. And I'm happy that it comes out. Skip all that. <clears throat> I'm happy that it, that it comes out quick. Sorry, guys. Excuse me. I'm preoccupied here with the hater. I mean, we got to... Oh, we got to take care of the haters, you know, sometimes you just got to they get so desperate, you know, they ask for so much attention and you just got to Oh, you know what I mean? You just sometimes you just got to wait a minute. Whoa, up. Sometimes you just got to, mm, you know, knock them off the throne off their little hating throne, so to speak. Anyways, Wolfstein looks dope. Uh, I like the game. I like I like how the shooting in there looks. It looks really tight. It looks sick. If y'all know what I'm talking about, go check out the trailer. Uh, just type in Wolfstein E3 2019. That's all you gotta type in. It's dope. It's sick. Luigi's Mansion 3. I'm so happy for that game. That game is on my Christmas list. Um, yes, it is. It's true. It's damn true. I'm gonna say like Kurt Angle. Shout out to my retro wrestling fans. It's true. It's damn true. But um, yeah, that game legit. Okay. Uh, gotta have it gotta get it uh i'm also excited about the uh <coughs> jesus christ i can't remember their names but two new characters in smash so i'm also happy about that that's dope but um i'm really excited for uh luigi's mansion got to look at the gameplay i like it it reminds me of the launch gameplay launch gameplay it reminds me of um sorry i'm just trying to focus on this thought and putting there in their place thought thought <laughs> Ah, which, okay, hold on. Let me see if I can get it. What happened? What happened? What What happened? Oh, dang. Mamas shouldn't have been thoughting around. Anyways, uh, um, Luigi, Luigi's Mansion 3 looks dope. It reminds me of the first Luigi's Mansion uh, for the GameCube back in like 02. That's way back. Um, oh, we doing this again? Leave me, leave me alone. There we go. Um, I think it's dope to say the least. Whatever, you know. I'm I'm a gear rabbit, you know, and all the other good stuff, you know. So yeah. Um. Anyways, uh, what's another game? Um. Let me see. I'm trying to think. Oh, you know what looked kind of dope? Fantasy Star Online. What's up with that though? Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think that was a, a dream, a Sega Dreamcast game from like the late '90s slash early 2000s. Uh, don't hold me to that, but I I think uh. One of the developers said that in an interview at E3 or something like that. Um, so I mean that's pretty cool. Oh, <laughs> made it rain on her. But um, yeah, that uh, I'm not really into games like that, but it's dope, you know. I mean I'm I'll give any game a chance. Um, what is it called again? Final yeah, Final Star, Final Star uh, Online. It looks really interesting. Speaking of Final, Final Fantasy VII remake. Now that's another those are that's another genre that I'm not really into, but I heard so much about it. I gotta, you know what I'm saying, I gotta give it a try. I gotta mess with the Final Fantasy. And I heard so 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 much good things about Final Fantasy 7 and Final Fantasy 10, I have to play them. So yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to the remake of Final Fantasy 7. Uh the game looks hot, so yeah, you know. My thoughts on that on the trailer of that game was fire, you know. So I'm looking forward to definitely copping that and playing that, you know. And I mean, y'all obviously know I'm looking, uh, looking forward to copping that Shang, uh, that Shang song, that combat pack that will be here. You dig? That should be here day one. You know what I'm saying? So be on the lookout for that. You know what I'm saying? Turn your notifications on because I know my videos be random. Like I'm, a, I'm, I'm pretty random with this right now. You know, pretty random. So just turn them notifications on. You know, and you ain't got to worry about nothing. You dig? You dig? Ski. But, um, another game uh, that caught my eye was Watch Dogs Legion. I mean, who, who, whose eye did, did, how can I, how can I word that right? Who didn't, um, who didn't have their eye caught <laughs> by that game? Who didn't have their eye caught by, uh, Final Fantasy? I, Final Fantasy. Who didn't have their eye, uh, caught by, uh, Wow, I just, I've been, I really spammed him. Let me, let me, let me be a little more original. God dang. Come on, I just forgot my combos. Let me see. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. I'm trying to bait him. Ah, it didn't work. Power up. Ah, boy. Oh, don't let me give it to you. Don't, don't let me get, that was, that was terrible timing. That was terrible. Man, let me hit a finisher on him. Since he want to stand in front of me like an idiot. All right, this is what you about to do, son. You about to ride the dark horse. 
Mm, take your soul away. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. I'll take your feet out. I'll take your feet out. Take the ankles out, boy, like a DB, like a like a safety coming down fast. Except he gonna hit low. Anyways, um, Jesus Christ, which game was I talking about? Oh, Watch Dogs Legion. The game looked dope. The game looked sick. Uh, we got so many minutes of gameplay of the game. Uh, I'm definitely feeling it. I'm looking forward to it. And that's about it. I'm trying to remember the date, but I can't remember the date of the game. But most of these games, I think, if I'm not mistaken, got like long dates. You know, but anyways, I mean, overall, as a whole, I pretty much enjoyed E3. <sighs> the game, excuse me, I burped. I pretty much enjoyed it, and I think it was all good. You know, I think it was all skiggity goo, skiggity goo. Um, a couple of bonus games I might add out there is what? Probably uh, Dead Island. What? Yeah. Dead, was it? Yeah, Dead Island. Dead Island 2. Uh, I know that that game, everyone been waiting on that game for like the last 20 years, you know. People been people been waiting on that game since the 80s, so, I mean, you know, enough said about that. Oh, whoa, whoa, he trying to, you trying to get hyphy. Hold on, calm all that down. Calm that noise down. You need to turn down. Turn down. <laughs> Yo, he fell on his head and got knocked out. <laughs> Wait, look, 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 look. Let's get a replay of that. Look, that. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, boy. Yeah. What? Yeah. Normally, I wouldn't be playing this trash, but I mean, yo, I don't get time to play games no more, man. So my combos and all that, they just, they just rinky dink. They just rinky dink suck, you know. But the whole point of me playing this is really just to take a break from MK. Believe it or not, I'm even though I rarely play that game, and I only played it when I made videos. I'm a little tired of it, I must say. But I know. Whoa, whoa, whoa hold up. Take it easy, son. Excuse me, guys. I had to put that put that dude in his place. But um, even though I'm a little kind of dare I say it, slightly bored with it, I know that Shang Song is really gonna shake it up. So yeah, can't wait for that. You know what I mean? That Shang Song, can't wait for that. Get off me, kid. Get off me. A couple of games, a couple other games to mention. Let me see. Dead Island. What else kind of caught my eye? Oh, there was a Splinter Cell announced. There was nothing. There was nothing about Splinter Cell, as far as like gameplay. I don't think they even really talked about it, but it, I guess it was just announced. Um, Metroid Prime was announced, but that's that's delayed. Uh, there was a cool game called Skull and Bones. There was no gameplay, but it was a trailer. Um, it kind of reminded me of Sea of Thieves, but like it was like the cross between Sea of Thieves and Assassin's Creed. It looked pretty sick. Control looked dope guys look that up type in uh, e3 control that game was pretty dope these are all games that um at least most of them are probably gonna purchase and definitely have on the chisel you fizzle <laughs> skadizzle you know so yeah looking forward to really all these games it looks like we got a pretty strong lineup for uh the rest of 2019 slash uh early 2020 so yeah now what I'm going to do now, while I think of more games that kind of caught my eye at E3, I'm going to try to be more original with this gameplay. Let me see. I, I used to have this sick... Man, I hate when they do this little clash. It doesn't throw me off rhythm. It's just so annoying. Don't you do it, mama. Don't, I, yeah, I can't do nothing. I forgot all my stuff. I, there was, I used to do a step back, and then I like kick, and then I'll do something like this or something. And I, no, no, I got it. I got it. There you go. I would do that, and then I would just BAM! I used to have some combos back in the day, man, you know, but, you know, that was back in the day. You know, that was then, this is now, unfortunately. Bop. What you got, mommy? Hola. Hmm? Hola, como estas? Bien? I hope not. <laughs> I hope not. Mm -mm. Cut all that noise out. Watch your ankles. Watch your ankles. Oh, oh, good God. That was a haymaker. Watch. She's just standing there. You ain't going to do nothing? You're wasting my time. You're a, you're a wait. But I'm going to put her down. You're wasting my time. You're a, wa you're a waste. A waste of my time. That's what you are. Exactly. Nothing else. A waste of my freaking time. You a thotty. 
Look, I never seen a thought wear a skirt that long. What's up with that skirt, though? Should she look? Should I make her ride the dark horse? Up. Oh. Whoa, she wants it. She wants to ride the horse. Okay, well you gonna get it. <laughs> ride the dark horse. I like how that sword just ripped through their chest and K that chest in. Come on, come here. That's like one of my favorite moves by him. That back down one. Oh yeah, the drop kick. The drop kick. I'm like mashing buttons because I didn't forgotten everything. You know, that's one of the things that kind of happens. I don't know if anyone else is like that. Probably not people who uh, play play fighting games like con continuously. But me, it's like when I play one fighting game and I try to go to a different fighting game, it just kind of like like the controls. You know what I'm saying? You get used to the MK controls and you come to a game like this, a Street Fighter, and it just kind of throws you off. You know, <clears throat> but anyways, y'all, look, I'm gonna stop it right there. I ran my mouth, I blabbered, I skiggity dude, I skiggity deed. You know, it's the kickback kid. We got Nightmare rocking the, the purple armor, representing kickback gaming, representing the purple theme. Ski, anyways, though, um, I just wanted to ramble a little bit randomly about um, some of the games and just kind of briefly give you know, just kind of just you know, briefly give my thoughts on. I know I didn't really go into to detail or whatever, I, mean, I just kind of ran my mouth, but. Anyways, I mean, all in all, you know, every game that I mentioned, I think it's dope. And I should be having at least most of them on the channel, you know. So, yup, that's it, y'all. This has been the Kickback Kid. You know what I mean? If you dig, you know what I'm saying? Put the, oh, gosh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> My head right now. I got a throbbing headache. Anyways, uh, um, this has been the Kickback Kid. You know what I'm saying? And that's just what it is. Make sure y'all turn the notifications on. Hit the like, share, subscribe. Channel from the ground up. We having fun over here. We playing games. We playing retro video games. You know what I'm saying? Straight originality over here, baby. <laughs> kickback, baby. My mama always told me I was going to break hearts. Anyways, so this has been a Kickback Kid. I'm out, y'all. Ski!